proudly covering the Northwest Arkansas community. This is KNWA News at 6. Rogers police are looking for two suspects in connection to a shooting in front of the Rogers Public Library this afternoon. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Alex Capriello. KNWA's Kelly O'Neill is live on the scene right now to bring us those the latest details from the police department. Kelly. Alex, that's right. Police are still searching for two suspects. Both are juveniles, and here's what we know so far. Rogers police got a call around 3 o'clock of shots fired in front of Rogers Public Library on Sycamore Street. Police say four juveniles met up. One pair was in a car and the other pair on foot. During this time, one juvenile was pistol whipped in the head with a gun, and one of the other suspects fired at least one round, but it did not hit anyone. The two kids then took off. The driver of the vehicle back over here behind us was struck in the head with a firearm by the two people that were on foot. They then fled the area. He drives around the corner, gets here and is like, oh my gosh, then stops and bails out of the car. Police say they do not know the condition of the juvenile that was pistol whipped, but they say they were taken to Mercy Hospital. And because they are all juveniles, no names or descriptions will be released. Rogers PD says there's no risk to the public. They're calling it an isolated incident. Again, one shot was fired, but it did not hit anyone, and one injury was reported, and that person is in Mercy Hospital. And Dixieland Road right here was, it was, uh, it was closed off for nearly two hours, but was just reopened. We're live in Rogers. Kelly O'Neill, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News. All right, Kelly, thanks for that update.